Hey there, I'm Miranda from Live Free Miranda and LiveFreeCreative.co and I'm here to show you all about getting set up with the AutoWrite steam machine to clean out your mommobile. I've been spending the last hour cleaning out my mommobile. It was pretty disgusting to start. If you want to click on the link in the description box, it'll send you over to my channel where you can see the full video, all of the embarrassing befores, and as we get through the afters. Um, but on this channel right now, I want to just open the box with you walk you through how to get started with your AutoWrite steam machine, what comes in it, flip through the manual with you, and actually get going so that you know how you can just get started uh, cleaning your mom mobile or anything else that you want to clean. You just got an AutoWrite steam machine and you're ready to get started using it. What you're going to see here are things that will come inside the box. You've got the manual, which you're going to want to throw away, but don't throw it away because there's so much good information in here and if you need to go back to it later or if someone else wants to use it and you want to lend it, so you're going to want to keep this around. The cutest machine, can we take just a second to acknowledge how cute this is? I was shocked when I opened it up that it's so small and it's red. It's darling. And then you're going to have a little funnel that'll help put the water in, a little measuring cup and a couple cloths. This one is stretchy. It's like a foot that'll hook around some of the attachments if you want to use it. It's microfiber and then a microfiber cloth. Um, things that you're going to want that are not included in the box are distilled water. Um, because of the way that the steam machine works, if you use water out of your tap, it's going to build up some mineral deposits and then that's a pain to clean later. So just go grab an 88 cents gallon of distilled water to get started. And then I know how dirty my car is. So I went and got a few more cloths and I think we're probably gonna go through them as we're cleaning today. You wanna plug in the machine to, a, um, to an extension cord or to the wall. And then this cap right here is where you're gonna add the water to the machine. So because it takes a couple minutes to warm up, I'm gonna add the water as we, um, and let it kind of warm up and, and build up pressure. And then I'll talk you through some of the attachments. We're set with water for now. That was easy twist this guy on tightly because there's going to be pressure building up in there so we're going to want to make sure it's all tight and nice. And then it says that you want to add um, whatever tip you're going to start with before you turn it on so I'm just going to obey the instructions and do that. So this is the straight tip not to be confused with this extendable tip. This one is longer as you can see. So this one is an attachment all of its own that's going to like get in between your seats and stuff like that. The straight tip, on the other hand, is the attachment that helps all of the attachments hook on. So this is kind of the main one you're going to use. You just click it right on there, it snaps in place with the button, and then any of these other attachments can slide right on there onto this tip. Does that make sense? So you're going to want to hook this one on first, and then once that one's on, all of the other ones can go on. Then you just press this giant on button and both of the, it's light outside so you can't see, but both of these lights are on right now, the orange light and the red light. And they're both gonna stay on until the steam has built up. And when the orange light turns off, that's when the machine's ready to use. That's what the manual says. I'm not making this stuff up. That's what it says, okay? One thing that I did not expect was a squeegee. So this is a squeegee attachment, which means you can clean windows with this thing. It will spray the steam and squeegee at the same time. Now it says that the glass shouldn't be below 32 degrees because you don't want to break it all, but um, that's a, a pretty cool attachment if you ask me. And then if you clip this piece off, that's an upholstery attachment. And that's one time that you can slide your microfiber little hat on and clean your upholstery with that. Pretty cool, right? So there's a couple brushes a bigger one and a smaller one. They're both pretty small, but like this one you can imagine getting into lots of nooks and crannies pretty easily. This one for a little bit wider areas. These are hard bristle, so they're gonna be for vinyl or plastic or cleaning metal. And then there's the same things in soft bristle. The gray is soft and the black is the hard. So these ones are for harder surfaces and these ones are for softer things like cleaning your leather or cleaning your upholstery. And then you also are going to find this tiny little squirty guy and this is going to help you get inside of lots of nooks and crannies on the actual hose this is a pretty substantial hose just when i was feeling like with everything was looking pretty clean inside my car i pulled out my center console and i found some pretty disgusting stuff under there including a wad of taffy that i have seen like in between the seats for months and I just couldn't quite get to it. So hopefully using the steam machine, I'm gonna be able to steam that all off and get it all clean so that I don't have to look at it anymore. You may wanna squirt it outside of your car for a little bit to get that water out before the steam happens. There it is. 
it's hot, so you don't want to point it at anyone or like an animal or yourself, like none of that. Pretend like it's a real gun and point it away from you towards like the dirt and yucky stuff like this taffy that I'm going to try to get right now. Hallelujah, the orange taffy is gone. We've got a lot of things going on. There's like dirt and something that looks like chocolate and something that looks like lemon cream. The whole thing just needs to be taken care of. So I'm excited to just get in there and take care of it because it's really bad. It just melts the best. I mean, seriously, I'm in love. Yeah, go ahead, take a look. Check that out. Five seconds later. So when we got this car a couple years ago, I made a very firm rule that there was to be no eating in the car. And that rule lasted like four days. And ever since, we've just been enjoying eating in the car <laughs> because snacks equal sanity and you just can't get around it. But luckily, you can clean it. Because of how hot the steam is, it's also sanitizing at the same time that it's cleaning, which makes it awesome for something like a car that you're in with your kids all the time and you know that there's germs everywhere. I want to mention while you're cleaning with the steam machine, there's hot steam coming out the whole time that you're pulling on the trigger. So don't leave it in one place because you could potentially melt whatever you're cleaning. So move it around, agitate it, use that brush, but don't just hold it still on your plastic or your vinyl or your leather so you don't damage the material that you're trying to clean. Since I'm going to be working on the leather seats, I'm going to use the soft bristle, bristle brush this time um, so that I don't damage the seats as I go and I can really kind of get scrubbing in there. So I'm just going to have that and a cloth on hand to just be wiping up as I go. So as we mentioned before, as I mentioned before, make sure that you're moving the whole time that you're cleaning and let's see how this goes. The weirdest thing is that I didn't feel like the seat was that dirty before I started, <laughs> but you can see the difference between where I've cleaned, where it's actually like light gray and this kind of dirty mess. This was white and now all of that came out in the last like 10 seconds of steam cleaning. We're just gonna get into some of these chocolate milkshake stains down here and see how they go. That, um definitely helps. So we did it. We cleaned out the, the mom mobile using the Autorite steam machine. I hope you enjoyed seeing how this machine magically cleans leather and the sticky taffy and cleans up the milkshake from the carpet, all of the nooks and crannies of your automobile that don't usually get touched by a wipe. And the Autorite steam machine is there for you. Remember to subscribe to the HomeRite channel if you want to get the latest tips and tricks and ideas about how to use their products. And if there's a product you would like to see a demonstration of or an unboxing of or get some more information about, go ahead and leave that in the comments and we'll do what we can to bring that to you. Have a nice day.